bone to slip this. And I need to wipe my mustache. Hey guys, oh, too close. Okay, hey guys, so this video is going to be a Valentine's Day inspired tutorial, and I am going to show you guys three makeup looks. Yes, three. You know what? I'm lying. Wait, three lip combos. I do one, this one eyeshadow look, and then I do three lip combos. This is the last combo, and that's why you're seeing it right now. So, we do a little chit-chatting. Um, I really don't have much to say right now <laughs> because it's snow outside. It's nasty. I'm off today. I have been honestly filming, editing, and uploading and like... A good amount of decent like a decent amount of time a good amount of decent time okay so yeah um we have this look um will i wear this for valentine's day maybe i will um i have been trying to i used to do makeup all the time and i have gone into this hole of neutral eye looks and that's about it so, I use the Omrezi Times Anastasia Beverly Hills um, eyeshadow palette, and I use like the pinks and the purples, which they came it came out really nice. Um, yeah. So, if you guys are interested in seeing how I got to this look and the other two lip combos, please stay tuned. And if you're not, please like comment and subscribe and share with your friends who knows um yeah so let's get into it hey you guys so the first thing we're going to be doing is priming and i'm using the milk hydro primer what My face is already moisturized and I have some sunscreen on because you wear sunscreen all year round. Please. Even though we're not getting any sun, UV rays and UVB. Okay. So now my face is primed. Yeah, I've been breaking out like crazy because it's just I have to wear the N95 again and it's just annoying. I am going to cover my dark spots with this concealer stick in well the Fenty Match Stick in Caramel and I'm just putting these on my, just putting it on my dark and red areas because your girl is red. And then okay. I'm just gonna use my fingers because it is a thick consistency to blend it out because the warmth of your fingers will help it will help manipulate it better and of course make sure your hands are clean okay 
cut. So now I'm taking my foundation. It is the Il Maquillage. I woke up like this and it is in 180. I actually need a new one. So I am taking a clean. This is just stained. It is clean. Make sure every time you use your beauty blender, you clean it right after. I'm going to just unscrew this and put some foundation on my beauty blender that's why it's always so stained but as long as it's clean it's fine and then we're going to just put that on and I'm going to start in the areas that I want the most coverage so that would be this cheek area because a lot of the product is already on the sponge make sure you go down your neck I really don't put a lot on my forehead area and or underneath my eye area because I use concealer and I contour so we don't want that to look real cakey so I just use the excess and put that there so the direction I want my channel to go in is basically you know with YouTube it's like you are just being yourself and I'm going to post some lifestyle because I just like, you know, doing my makeup, getting dressed, you know, putting on different wigs and I'm a mom so I have to, you know, cook clean and I'm a student and I also work so I just like that I have that option to do all of those things and tie that into one um channel so the concealer i'm using is the makeup forever velvet skin and it is 4.4 and it just looks like this so me being true to myself and i don't go all the way up because you'll see what i'm about to do and then I just like lightly blend down and out but I focus most of my products in this area and if you can see I don't go all the way underneath my eyelid so we're gonna do the same thing and bring this out a little and put a little bit here just so we can even out because I need to put some here. I am a little bit red. Well, not a little bit. I'm a lot. And just to make the face symmetrical. Um... And I'm just taking whatever is left off this brush and blending out the edges. Mommy, when I was cleaning all the stuff off my mirror, when I was wiping my mirror, guess what I saw? What? So, uh, I saw hidden frozen characters underneath. You did? Uh-huh. I was like wiping and literally, wait, what was that? And then I wiped it a little more to see it better. And then I actually saw Anna Elsa. But I didn't get the other one's face yet. Okay. I'm just using the side with the foundation on the areas that I don't want so bright, which is like the bottom over here where I'm going to contour. So that can just blend in. my lip, my forehead, 
and then I'm going to take the clean side and blend up and you don't want to put foundation directly underneath your eye because that's what gives you the more likelihood of your under eyes creasing. Samsa and blend that with uh, a Sigma E25 and we're going to put that in the crease right over New Yorker and OG. gonna take a Mac one a Mac 224 and just blend this out this is nothing on it y'all please 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 blend your eyeshadow because I like it stresses me out okay school going it's going I'm still in the race 
I'm making it through. I'm now going to take um, a Sigma E25 and I'm going to take the color, let's see, Cupcake and Anastasia. And we're going to mix those two together. Cupcake, a little bit of Anastasia. And we're going to pat that on the lid. No, we're going to use our finger. brush and blend it out we're going to take a little bit of samsa and blend it out like a little looking for my um, angel lipstick by MAC so I'm gonna show you guys three looks I'm gonna show you like a salt pink look a pink pink and a red that is like ooh so first I am going to line my lips for the first look I'm going to use the Luna lip liner from the Il Maquillage and Carly Bible collection going to use my YSL lipstick I don't know what color this is honestly like I can't tell you so this is what it looks like it's a pink and uh, it's literally angel is the dupe this is angel by MAC but more luxurious And then I'm gonna top it off with Morning Glory. This, oh. I used to go crazy over this. this is the look I just added a headband you know uh -oh. so now for the second clip let me just wipe this off We are going to use Brick by MAC. So 
someone left my bathroom light on downstairs. I hear it. So if you hear it too, sorry. And then we're going to add Fenty Stunner Lip Paint in Unlocked. So now we're going to do the last lip. But we gotta get this off. Let me get a makeup wipe. Look how bomb. Yo, this is killing me. I need to go get a facial. Look how bomb this lip is. And I need to work my mustache. Ooh! I'm gonna use uncensored stunner paint. If I can open it. Okay, let's let this dry. Oh, man. So I was trying to like film a reel and use Rihanna's music and can't find it. So I'm using my favorite Beyonce song. Why not? <laughs> 